if you're unable to do wheelies with your snow machine, the problem most likely is the front shock in your track area. It is too soft. You need to tighten it up and make it stiffer. And that's what we're going to go ahead and do today. Let me know in the comments if you had this issue before and what your uh, thought was after you tightened up that front spring. My snow machine is a Polaris Pro RMK 800 with a 155 track and it's a 2015. The tool bag on this particular uh, model of Polaris is right in this area. So we got to go ahead and untwist two of these and then undo this bungee strap and then pull the cowling open. Now the tool bag is right here beside the oil tank. So let's go ahead, unzip that and pull it out. It's a little tight in there. We'll go ahead and just stick it back up temporarily. This is the wrench we're going to use to tighten the spring on the middle shock on this particular Polaris. Here is the shock that we're going to be adjusting. As you can see, uh, right here is the thread and the locking nut is all the way to the bottom. What we want to do is move it up uh, approximately halfway up to three quarter of the way up to stiffen up this front section of the track and that will make the snow machine want to ride up on top of the snow versus plowing through the snow. On this particular spring over shock, there is no locking screw on it, so we don't have to worry about loosening that before we start twisting the locking nut on it. All you do is you take this wrench, stick it in the little hole, and twist it around. This little piece goes right in these little holes indents in the nut. I've got it about halfway. I'm gonna go a little bit more, about three quarter of the way up. As the nut uh, goes up, it gets tighter and it's a little bit harder to twist it. But Okay, that about 60% to three quarter of the way up. I think I'm gonna stop there and call it good for this job. Don't forget to put your tool away in your tool bag and then put it back to where it goes. Since we didn't tighten these up, all you have to do is just pull that out and then stick the bag back in in the little case it goes in. Zip it up. And then pop the side cowling back on. 